<laughs> a little icicle should start to form around the screen, right? Sort of like when you get shot in, in like a first person shooter game, you get the jelly jam all over your screen like, Oh no! Little blots of my blood have gone into my eyeball, right? I mean, I've always kind of like... <laughs> My, my headcanon for it is that, like, my character is wearing, some for some reason, even though they definitely are not, and you definitely should not if you're, like, <laughs> some sort of person in a firefight. Oh, shit. Power wizards. Oh, fuck. No. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. My horse is about... Remember when I said my horse would die? Oh, God. Oh, my God. Oh, go, dude. Oh, why is my horse's ass explode? When we had last left the last dragonborn, they were inside of the Forsaken Cave and the Forsaken Crypt they led into one another, dodging past terrible traps and wicked wizards of yore, yes, risen Draugr dudes, one named Kuramil or something. I don't know if he was a wizard, was he? No. <laughs> Terrible warriors of yore who, who rose from their grave to do battle with the Dragonborn. And at the end of it all was their prize. Yes, not the fantastic word wall, but indeed the legendary white file, which they discovered was broken. <laughs> and after a long trek back to the city of Windhelm, they turned it back in to Norellian, who was pretty bummed about it being broken. However, they were given a weird... Well, no, they weren't given that test just yet. Someday, they would come back to that place and there would be something else waiting for them. But for now, fuck that old man. It was time to head on up. Yes, further north into the billowing cold, up to the College of Winterhold. This is the Elder Scrolls V Skyrim. Welcome back. Let's do a quick save here because, wow, it is looking like... A pretty frigid day. This might be maybe a really bad day for traveling all the way up there, but we'll see. <laughs> Look at this. Yeah, just in the middle of the city, my my frostiness is pulsating. But anyway, let's see here. In between videos, I of course rested up because we were quite sleepy. Got a point in Magicka. We'll probably get that up to 250 through wearing the Necromancer's Amulet, so it'll be resting at 200 unbuffed. I believe, yeah, because it gives 50. And our perk skill point that we picked up was, of course, what we were building toward. That alteration one. Good lord, where is it? There it is. Really cool how it's not an alphabet. Is there any rhyme or reason to the order in which it's in? I know, like, ones at the border are the the crafting ones, right? Because alchemy, yeah, it's kind of sneaky, kind of kind of wizardy, right? And over here, it's enchanting. Yeah, yeah, can, you can kind of see. How they, how they bridge the gap and shit, right? Yeah, it kind of makes sense. I mean, that said, archery and light armor being here. I mean, I guess that kind of makes sense, right? But yeah, the ones at the core tend to be more... More like how you deal damage, I guess? No, because archery's not there. Yeah, I have no idea. I have no idea. Maybe maybe things that speak to the, the overall sign back here. I don't know the rhyme or reason, but anyway, <laughs> what we picked, there is, there is definitely some sort of reasoning to it, right? Like, it seems like these are your damage ones? I'm not sure. And these are like lockpicking and pickpocket, things most relevant to the sign, the thief, right? And here, of course, everyone knows warriors love block and two-handed. <laughs> yep. And, like I said... Got the alteration point right up here. Let's see, when is actually our next level in that? 50. Hmm. A small but not inconsequential upgrade. All right, let's head on up. Let's check our map to the College of Winterhold. Jeez, I'm Pete. We could also knock up the Shrine of Azura while we're heading through here, but I think we'll keep it simple for now. We could always head down south from Winterhold to get the Shrine, right? Because that may be a safer bet as far as the cold is concerned. As we're cutting through here, we're going to probably freeze our nips off in a major way. Alright. Let's head on out. Let's haul ass. Here we go, baby. As soon as we see a monstrous dude, we'll probably pick up some, some food. I did steal a little bit of food from the kitchen of the inn here in Windhelm. Which is, of course, where I slept. 
but stole some of their delicious food, cooked it up, made a beef stew, made some like haunches and pheasant, all that good stuff. So we should be good to go. Wow, yeah, this is, this is gonna be a rough one. <laughs> this one's not gonna be good. We might actually have to use some camping supplies because of the inclement weather. Good God, man. All right. Let's see, let's grab a horse real quick. We're on like some sort of secret timed mission. Horse, oh, we got a bounty. Okay, it's fine. We're getting the hell out of here. Who saw us? Who even saw us and reported that crime? I don't know. Okay, we're heading back over this way. Here we are. Oh shit. Yeah, they want to fucking rumble, don't they? Well, not today. Can I swivel my camera while- <laughs> Well, no, but I can like- I can like burn out my horse. Look at this. <laughs> Hang on. <laughs> no, it won't do it anymore. I think I've ran out of stamina. There it is! Ooh, la <laughs> Good lord, it's like you're getting ready to charge up your- your Mario Kart boost at the beginning. <laughs> As the lights are changing color. Oh my gosh, slam on the, the gas as soon as it turns yellow or whatever. Get your speed boost early on with the horse. <laughs> Good lord. Alright, let's head on up over here. Oh hey! It's our friend, Maik. And who is this? I'm on a pilgrimage to the Shrine of Azura, the Goddess of Twilight. Alright. Good luck, me. dude. You're gonna fr probably freeze or something. I'm I'm on my way sort of through there. Too bad we can't offer be like, hey yeah, hop on back of my horse. Okay. Let's see. Are we heading the right way? Yeah, okay. So we have kind of been along the road that we need to take, right? Instead of going off road when we went to the Forsaken Cave, we just stay on the path. It should lead us up there. Ooh, man, the real worst of it will be you know, when we go up here, <laughs> if we start freezing in a major ass way, and guess who we can't find? Ilya, with all of our camping supplies, and we just fall over frozen dead. Good God, what a nightmare that would be. But that'll probably, we'll, we'll probably be fine. She'll warp around and teleport and find us or something, right? We should be fine. <laughs> Famous last words. This is uh, maybe one of our chilliest adventures, I'm not sure. Because even when we were climbing to High Hrothgar, it was like a good, nice day out. It wasn't like overcast, literally snowy day, right? Can, does it get snowier than this? I don't think you ever experience a, a full-on blizzard, do you? Maybe you do in these upper northern reaches. I can't remember. It's been so long. Oh, hey. Who's this? We can kind of discern by just riding by them. Important deliveries to make. No time for chatting. Oh. Hey. Is it for me? No, must not be. Okay, I'm very reticent to jump off of this fucking horse. If I get off of this horse, I'm dead. <laughs> if I dismount the horse, we may as well just freeze to fucking death out here. Alright, here we go. This is kind of fun, though. <laughs> this cold element. Ooh! Ooh, man. Ooh! It's a little bit nippy here. <laughs> Everything's turning blue. Oh, gosh. Okay. Up here, a little icicle should start to form around the screen, right? Sort of like when you get shot in, in like a first-person shooter game, you get the jelly jam all over your screen, like, Oh no! Little blots of my blood have gone into my eyeball, right? I mean, I've always kind of like... <laughs> my, my headcanon for it is that like my character is wearing, some, for some reason, even though they definitely are not, and you definitely should not if you're like <laughs> some sort of person in a firefight. Oh shit! Power wizards. Oh, fuck! No! Oh my god. Oh my god, my horse is about- Remember when I said my horse would die? Oh god! Oh my god! Go! No! Oh, go, dude! Oh, why is my horse's ass explode? No! Oh, fuck. Oh, this is fucked up. We're in wizard country now! Oh, shit, where did my horse even go? Did it go flying out from under my ass? Oh, no! Ew. I'm taking that. All right. <sighs> Who are you? Are you a courier? Oh, gosh. I've heard tale of couriers with great power and courage. Are you one of them? <laughs> are you? You're a farmer. Oh, God. <laughs> Hey, you know what? How many stories have some farmer rising up from humble beginnings? Guess what? Now's your chance! <laughs> Now's your chance, farmer! 
Oh gosh, oh no, that's Ilya. Okay. <laughs> there she is. Mighty Ilya strides through the frozen wastes. Okay, look. Holy shit, look at the view distance. I think it's warmed up as well. Yeah, look, we're not freezing our tits off in a major way. Look, we, we can actually take some time to speak to it. Wow, it's actually warm here. Oh my god. What? How? What's up, farmer? I'm on my way to solitude to join the Legion. A united empire is better for everyone. Sure, man. Yeah, especially in light of who we're up against, right? <laughs> Probably for the best, right? They are really bad folks. <laughs> All right. Should we just kind of hang out here for a bit and, <laughs> and heal up? Oh, feeling warmer. This is good. Look, everything stopped being blue. Oh my gosh, look, what kind of boon is this? Is this from Azura? Is this some sort of blessing Azura is smiling down on me today? Wow, she has put that sun there. Moon and star. I mean, you know, I guess it's a star. Do they... I guess probably in Elder Scrolls Land they don't refer to the sun as a star. What even do they call it? Huh. Sun, right? They just... they call it the sun. Right? Man, I can't believe I don't... Yeah, weird. Do they have, like, a weird Elder Scrolls name for the sun? I know they'll still call, like, Mesa and Secunda moons at times. But is there an Elder Scrolls-ass name for the sun? Do some people, like, regard it as Magnus or some shit? I'm not sure. Oh, look. My heat has gone away, so we'll continue moving. That was a nice little treat there. Oh my gosh. Good, good, good. Oh, look, a creepy cave. Stillborn Cave. Wow! What a terrible name for a cave! Hey, look, a cave. Oh my god! Wonder what's inside. Probably a bunch of dead fucking babies, Ilya. What the fuck? Let's go in and say hello! <laughs> huh. Oh god, is this one of them? Like a giant's baby? Some sort of occult like cross? Hmm. Here lies James Howlett? Okay, let's head on up here. Stillborn Cave. Ooh. Ooh. This might be ill-advised. Oh shit, this is a Falmer Cave. Should we measure ourselves up against them and see how well we do these days? Why not? Let's take a quick peek and a poke. I'll eat an apple pie that I've stolen. How about... Oh yeah, I couldn't cook up these crab legs. Hmm. I should have actually look at, looked at the recipe, right? But I didn't think to. Because, you know, I'm, I'm dumb. Let's do a quick save. And let's fight this big bastard. I've got we'll just see how quickly we can go. No commitment to doing this. Because if anything, it'd be way smarter to... Oh my god, it's a reaper! Oh my gosh! There we go. Ugh. We're doing okay. Holy shit, we're kind of carving into this thing. Wow, we fucked it up. Okay, man, we still got on Legendary. Are we just doing that fucking good now? Are we like owning it all up? Let's double check and make sure. Yeah, there it is. Legio. All right. Let's see, man. Maybe we will clear this shit out. Fuck me. Maybe I'm fucking unstoppable. <sighs> Anything else around here? Is there, like, a secret entrance or exit anywhere around here? No, probably not. All right. Let's clear it on out. I'm feeling lucky. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, God. Hello? Ooh! We got pooped right out. There you go. Eat bugs. Oh, shit! All right, it was a lot tougher than the <laughs> than the Charis. Okay, maybe we will head back out and go get some some upgrades from the college. That's a good idea. All right, you know we've had our fun. It's time to get upgrades. We've warmed up a little. Well, no, we've we've actually gotten colder in here. <laughs> we've uh, we've frozen our ass off just a bit. Okay, there we are. Good, good, good. Okay. Oh. Huh. Oh, look. Some delicious ore of some sort. It's iron. Here, Ilya. 
Trust me to pick. Let's see here. I've got your back. What there do you want are. me to carry? Oh, you know what? Um, uh, some gentle viewer wrote in. Gosh, I forgot who. Didn't think to that would come up, but I posed the question, or more so, I posed my disbelief that companions could mine. And actually, it's certain companions can mine, and certain ones can chop wood. Amazingly enough, oh my God, Farmer Brown has died. Who killed him? Oh my gosh. Maybe it was that thing. What the fuck is that long-legged freaky thing? Oh god, it's coming after me to attack! Okay. Well, let's fucking rumble, I guess. Oh, it's an ice wolf. Yeah! Oh. There we go. You know what? It doesn't do much damage. Maybe we tank some hits and level up our shit. Yeah! Oh fuck. Yeah! Double healing! Oh, double healing! Please! Oh god, this is dangerous shit, leveling up like this! Okay. Alright. Let's go again. There we go. Ooh! Ooh! Man, that thing is big! This thing could be like a fucking mount. Alright, let's heal on up. Look at that, some sort of stoned henge out over there to the northeast. What is that? Oh, it's a dragon burial site, isn't it? I think so. No dragon around here. Oh shit, there is something. Some sort of giant cat? And some sort of person chasing after it? Huh. Oh no, it's a horse. Oh! And like a shitload of trolls. Wow, look at them all go. That person is dead. Look, there's another person over here. What is going on? Who are all of these people? Where are they all doing? Snow Fox and... Oh shit, it's a bandit. Okay. Let's steal your soul. There we go. Wow, that guy was actually pretty... Pretty weak. Go... Take this, because remember we picked up the one black soul gem not too long ago. <laughs> I don't have some like wild ass capability here. I just remembered that we had a ooh shit, you're a marauder, huh? Man, almost him riding the noggin with a soul trap. He would just faint from that. Can I get him? Yes. I'd really rather not fuck with a bunch of trolls and shit, but. Okay, let's see, let's get our... Should we mark for death? Everyone said, so many folks wrote in for this, saying that this is really good, but it's so overpowered, it's like super bugged if you don't have the unofficial patch installed, which fortunately, we do. But we also need to be very careful about landing it on companions and stuff. Three. There we go. Good. This guy's kind of tough. Here we are. Good. Well, he was tough, but now he's just- Ooh! Shithead! Whew. Okay. <laughs> What's my healing shit like? Let's get some. Can I dodge your arrows? Oh, fuck! No, I can't! Okay. <laughs> uh, let's take some of that. Good. Oh god, the troll lords. Okay. Ilya, do we- <gasps> Oh, fuck you, dude! There are trolls here! Oh shit, can I steal their horse? <laughs> yes! Get the fuck out! Get the fuck out! Go, 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 Prior Mabel, go! Ooh. Ooh, 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 ooh. Wow, amazing, we've done it. <laughs> Who the fuck is this? Who are you? What are you up to? Are you just a guard? You might just be a guard. Hmm. Hey, there's a shitload of trolls and bandits over there. You might want to look into that. Wherever the hell you are, wow. This should be good. Yeah, Winterhold Guard. Oh, they're just watching Ilya fight. <laughs> this should be good, great. Okay, sure. <laughs> Why not? Sounds about right. 
Okay, let's continue on over to Winter Hall. All right. You know what? We lost a prior Mabel along the way, but so too did we gain one. Yes, that's right. Every single horse that I lay my ass upon is prior Mabel. It's true. It's a... It's a real Geralt Roach. Oh, fuck situation! Oh, God, it's stomping around. Oh, God, it's gonna get me! Go, Prior Mabel, go! Fuck off! Holy shit! Oh, God. All right, I think we're in the clear. Are we safe? <laughs> I hope there's actually Winterhold guards in Winterhold. Otherwise... <laughs> Let's see. Anybody here? Anybody who can do some good shit? No? Oh, here they are, yeah. Oh, I think we lost them too. Where else could I even go in this god's forsaken town? Oh. The air is treacherously cold. But it's worth a try. Who's this man talking to? The chicken? <laughs> Maybe. Alright. Well, first things first, we should get acquainted with the wizard skill. Or the College of Winterhold. Let's go on up here. Good. How far can I get with this horse? Oh, can I just bust through here? Hey! <laughs> huh. What's gonna happen if I keep going like this? Uh. Hey, what's gonna happen? Don't they usually bar your path? Can I actually get in? Oh, shit. Shit. All right, fine. Sorry, Ilya. Too bad we can't have Ilya pass the entrance exam. Whoa, fuck! Oh, prior Mabel's fucking wild and... All right, we're fine, we're fine. Okay. There we go. Oops. <laughs> we're gonna need to talk to her. All right. Cool. Cross the bridge at your own peril. Oh. The way is dangerous. The gate Gotta turn my head slowly. You shall not gain entry. Hey, what is this place? Oh, forgive me. Most who arrive here do so because they have heard of the college before. This is the College of Winterhold, a safe haven for mages in Skyrim, a place of wisdom and arcane knowledge. Oh. You know what? I'm going to tap out of that and get closer to her so I can hear her better. <laughs> Let's see. Hey there, Veralda. Greetings. Welcome to the College of Winterhold. Oh my god, how do you stand it out here? Jesus. Welcome to the College of Winterhold. I am Feralda, one of the senior wizards here. I trust you found your journey to Winterhold not entirely unpleasant. It was now, incredibly I unpleasant. If your only purpose in being here is to complain, you would be far better off speaking with the Jarl of Winterhold. Where is the Jarl of Winterhold? If, however, you seek something more, I will be happy to assist you. Okay. Why would I want to complain about the college? <laughs> it is no great secret that we have been unjustly blamed for a great many things over the years. The good people of Skyrim, on occasion, would rather pass judgment than attempt to understand what we do here. I can't Thus, believe they'd we must ever take do that. <laughs> precautions in order to secure our safety. Uh, why are you out here? It's cold. <laughs> why are you out here? I am here to assist those seeking the wisdom of the college. And if, in the process, my presence helps to deter those who might seek to do harm, so be it. The more important oh, damn. question is, why are you here? I'm cold! <laughs> That's my... Man, being on survival really makes me acutely aware of how much cold people in Skyrim are willing to fucking withstand. <laughs> I mean, look at this! This is hardly... She's not even wearing gloves! Jeez! All right. Hey, may I enter the college? Perhaps. But what is it you expect to find within? Wizards! <laughs> I want to use the power of ice and fire to destroy any who oppose me. I desire to bend the will of those around me. I want to unravel the mysteries of Aetherius. I just wanted to see what it looks like inside. What if we say that? Let's say that. Ha. Huh. Humor is often in short supply here. But I sense that perhaps you're after more than just that. Okay. <laughs> it would seem that the college I can't has lose. what you seek. The question now is what can you offer the college? Not just anyone is allowed inside. Those wishing to enter must show some degree of skill with magic. 
A small test, if you will. I think we both know I'll succeed here. No, I want to take the test. I'll take your test then. Excellent. The Flame Atronach is a vital companion for anyone relying on conjuration. Oh, thank God. Summoning one here would certainly show your skill. Do they ask um, you to do one depending on, like, what's your highest wizard skill? I bet that's got to be it. Okay, I can do that. I look forward to it. Because I think I remember doing a destruction spell my first time here, right? No matter what, I think I remember the doing that. Will endure. <laughs> Too bad I, <laughs> I can't, like, stand in front and, like, <laughs> shout a whole bunch of stuff and have Ilya shoot one out from behind me. I'll show you my mastery over the frigid cold uh, summoned from a Sirius itself. Ha! Blizzard! And then Ilya, like, quietly in the distance, shoot, shoots one out, and she's like, My god, you're the ultimate wizard lord. <laughs> All right, let's go. Let's do some of this. I you know, may or may not have done that in World of Warcraft. <laughs> to try and trick people into thinking that I was a warrior who could somehow... Or no, it was the other way around. I got my friend to stand in, in like, a, in the middle of Goldshire. One of the early level towns and stuff. Saying, <laughs> saying like, Come see, B Blizzard, the developers have added new abilities to my class. I can shoot a fireball. And then he would just scream in chat, Fireball! And then I was like a wizard. I had like glitch jumped on top of the inn. And I would shoot a fireball down from the top of the inn at like a chicken or a rabbit. And people would be like, oh my god! <laughs> or they were either playing around or or they, they were having a laugh at all of it as well. But one guy was like, you're not a wizard! That is not how the video game works! And he got so fucking annoyed. We just kept going on with it and on with it like, no, they added it in in patch 2.3. Yes, I am the fireball. <laughs> I shot another one down. <laughs> and the guy was like, hey, I see you up there. He started whispering at me, sending me private messages like, you can't trick me. <laughs> it was so fucking funny. All right. Anyway, anyway, <laughs> sorry. Story time is over. I'm freezing my ass off. There. I call well her Francine. Done, I think you'll be a superb addition to the college. Welcome, apprentice. I'll lead you across the bridge. Once you're inside, you'll want to speak with Mirabelle Irvine, our master wizard. Please, follow me. Master wizard. Okay. Oh! You almost shot Francine with that thing. Gosh, I'm getting so cold my eyeballs are like freezing in their fucking sockets. Oh, have you ever been in cold so biting like that? Like, it, it's actually freezing your fucking eyeballs a bit. And, like, you start to cry in order to, like, get over the cold of it. Have you ever had that happen in real life? Holy shit, it's not good. <laughs> it's like, fuck, I need to get some, like, fucking goggles or something. Jeez, some snow goggles. Yeah, just take your time. I'm only, like, half dead from the fucking cold. My fingers are starting to fall off. Jeez. I trip and fall into the frozen water below, killing myself instantly. <laughs> Good God. All right, Feralda. Come on. What happens if I talk Much to her? knowledge oh, lies God. within the college's okay, walls. Okay, okay, okay. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I really am going to die now. It'll be my fault this time. No matter what, the college will endure. Ooh, I'm getting warm. Is it this pleasant conversation, Feralda? Wait, does this stuff warm me up? Oh my god, this stuff warms me up! What? Will this shit, like, burn me? Can I get in this? Oh my god! <gasps> We're just like it! We're... Ilya, this is just like the, uh, the College of the, the Imperial University! The Arcane University! They have blue fire here that doesn't- Oh, look! I'm like, I'm going Super Saiyan mode! <laughs> Look at me, Ilya. <laughs> Sorry, Ilya. All right, I'm I'm having a good time here and warming up at the same time. You know, it's good. I know you never get cold, Ilya, because you have the heart of a terrible craven witch. But I do. <laughs> I get very cold. <laughs> Gosh, Ilya, she's so fucking cold-blooded. She'll just <laughs> kill her own mom. <laughs> I know you, Ilya. I know all about you. <laughs> Alright. Wow, look at this. 
I don't remember this being so blue. Is this due to the special edition turning up the saturation? Look at that contrast, huh? Looks kind of neat. This is the most Skyrim looking place though. Well, everything is just <laughs> 5,000 different shades of gray. Oh my gosh. Where's our horny room? Oh, here I it is. I've made myself rather clear. Yes, of course. I'm simply trying to understand the reasoning behind the decision. You may be used to the Empire bowing to your every whim, but I'm afraid you'll find the Thalmor received no such treatment here. You are a guest of the College, here at the pleasure of the Archmage. I hope you appreciate the opportunity. Yes, of course. The Archmage has my thanks. Very good. Then we're done here. He doesn't even try to hide the fact that he's he's like such a fucking villainous dude. Welcome he's the, the way he speaks. Could you imagine going up and like <laughs> going up to someone in the grocery and they're like, Welcome to Yes, the these are freshly picked pears. Very ripe. Feel their firmness. Like, oh my Welcome god, this person college. is going to like try and dominate the world. <laughs> Alright. Mirabelle Irvine. To the oh, thank you. She said so nice. She said it thrice. I I was told to come see you. Another new student. I'm surprised at how many of you there are lately. Well, really? first you'll need these. While you're not required to wear them, you may find them more to your liking than your current clothes. I doubt it. I'll give you a brief tour, and then we'll get you to your first class. Are you ready to begin? Uh, I'd love to have a look around. Wonderful. Please follow me and don't wander off. Oh, okay. The College of Winterhold has been a fixture in Skyrim for thousands oh. of years. The prominent feature here is the Hall of the Elements. It's our primary location for lectures, practice sessions, and general meetings. Is this the it? The Arcanium is located above the Hall, and the Archmage's quarters above that. While is that technically it? in charge of the College, the Archmage's responsibilities often keep him occupied. Thus, I run the day-to-day -day operations. Now, if you'll please follow me, I'll show you the living quarters. Oh, okay. Unfortunately, I'm guessing that was it. To implement more stringent entry procedures due to some problems with the local Nords. Uh oh. We don't anticipate any real violence, but it never hurts to be prepared. Hmm. It's unfortunate that you never get any like local Nords showing up, being like, "What the fuck." I think you have, like, an outreach to Winterhold, though, don't you? You do, like, an outreach program to try and support the local folks down in Winterhold. But they're never up here, like, My baby was stolen in the dead of night by a fucking wizard! <laughs> we all look and turn to Elia. <laughs> Good lord. Poor fucking Elia. <laughs> Our newest members are housed here, in the Hall of Attainment. I'll ask that you please keep your voice down while inside, as others may be working on research or delicate experiments. Okay. Sure. Or are we going in? Oh my gosh, oh we are. This is how people open doors. They just ever so gently, like, shove their fingers into it. <laughs> now I'll show you to your quarters. You're going to be sharing space with your fellow apprentices, who you'll meet shortly. Cool. I think the college is this is where you'll be staying. This bed and desk are yours. Please try and be considerate of others. Now, let's go back to the Hall of the Elements, where most of the members gather for lectures and study sessions. Cool, is this shit mine too? I think it is. Wow, I'm, I'm just gonna take this right now. Gosh, all I had to do was show them Francine and they let me in here and take all this shit. Wow. Are these... Hey, are these real people? Oh no. Oh no! <laughs> At least this is in my house, I guess. <laughs> alright, alright, I'm coming, I'm coming. Initially, you'll be learning from Tolfdir, one of our most esteemed wizards. Oh gosh, what about you? Oh yeah, you do like, you're like the secretary. Who actually does all the work or something? Something like that? How much paperwork does a wizard even have at a college like this? Because they have a librarian. I was about to say, maybe they sort through all the, like, information and books and stuff that come through. But no, it's the librarian who does that. Yeah, what does the Archmage even do here? Especially in a place like Skyrim, where, where there's so few, like, other guild houses and stuff. Is likely already addressing the new apprentices. Go oh. on in, and if you have any problems, let one of our senior members know. Okay. Thanks. 
Wow, look at that. Oh, look at them. Just ready to grab a few apples <laughs> in their hands. Can we, like, go and telekinesis some apples right into their hands? <laughs> Jeez. All right. It almost seems in defiance of, um, of Azura over there, right? You know? Though I guess it seems more like, um, oh, what's it called? Uh, Christo whatever, right? That famous real world statue? I forget. I forget the, the name of it, technically. You always build it in, in civilization, don't you? All right. Let's head on out over here. Ooh. The all-seeing eye of Agamotto. Can I just kill this guy right now? What what happens if I try and kill this man? I have many important things on my mind. Your concerns are not among them. Ilya! <laughs> <laughs> wow! I didn't even get a bounty for that! People hate this man that much! I just walked in here and screamed, Aah! threw an axe right into his shoulder. Nobody gave a shit. <laughs> hey! Another new apprentice, I see. <laughs> are you of the sort that believe you're here to change the world? Or are you only in it for yourself? I assure you that I shall be watching you, all of you, very closely. Gosh, he sounds like such a fucking supervillain. Come on, all he's missing is a mustache to twirl. What was that conversation with Mirabelle about? What is it you do here? I'd like to know more about the Thalmor. What was that conversation? Your superior and I were simply having a discussion about my level of access to the college. Your discussion sounded like an argument. Some kind of problem? Nothing you need to concern yourself with. I shall be quite capable of observing everything that goes on here. Okay. What is it you do here? I am an advisor to the Archmage. The Thalmor wish to promote relations with your college. I am at the huh. Archmage's disposal if he requires advice. Oh, do you think they were trying to... Initially, the... I wonder if initially they were just trying to... Sway the College of Winterhold against Skyrim and cause more, mm. more chaos in the region, right? Because already there's tension... Um, with local Nord culture and the use of magic and, like, establishments that practice magic in this way. Or maybe they already knew about, like, the sweet-ass dope relic that they would come into contact with, and that's what he hoped. I'm not sure. Maybe we eventually find some information about him here. Or, like, maybe not in this quest, but in the main quest? I don't know. I'd like to know more about the Thalmor. Now that stability has been established between the Dominion and the Empire... We seek only to help Skyrim, to guide its mm. people through this time of transition, to help lead them to a better future. Okay. <laughs> Does the Archmage often ask for advice? Perhaps not as often as he should. In time, I believe he will be more trusting. Hmm. All right. Good to know. Can I Can I just attack him again? I have many <laughs> Hey, look, Your everybody! <laughs> look at this asshole. Hang on. Third time's a charm, right? Uh, uh. Uh. Wow, no one gives a shit, huh? Can I just level up my shit here? Uh. Yep. There Where'd we go. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit! Okay, he got uh. mad. He got uh. mad. Oh, fuck! <laughs> okay, he finally did get, get mad at us. <laughs> I thought on the third hit, that would have been enough for him. <laughs> shit, shit, shit. All right, Tolfdeer, what's up? Welcome, welcome. We were just beginning. Please, stay and listen. So, as I was saying, yes, stay a the first while. thing to understand is that magic is, by its very nature, volatile and dangerous. Unless you can control it, it can and will destroy you. Oh, good. Sir, I think we all understand that fairly <laughs> well. We wouldn't be here if we couldn't control magic. Of course, my dear, of course. You all certainly possess some inherent natural ability. That much is not being questioned. What I'm talking about is true control. Mastery of magic. It takes years, if not decades, of practice and study. Then what are we waiting for? Let's get started. Please, please. This is exactly what I'm talking about. 
Eagerness must be tempered with caution, or else disaster is inevitable. But we've only just arrived here. You've no idea what any of us are capable of. Why not give us a chance to show you what we can do? You've been quiet so far. What do you think we should do? Oh my god, a b teleporting bald man. I'm not really sure what to think. I think we should learn something practical. Safety should be more important than anything. Fuck no, let's fucking send the rest of this fucking place into the water. <laughs> I think we should learn something practical. Is that so? See, he agrees with us too. Why don't you actually show us something? All right, let's settle down. I suppose we can try something practical. In continuing with our theme of safety, we'll start with wards. Wards are protective spells that block magic. I'll teach you all a ward, and we'll see if you can successfully use it to block spells, all right? Would you mind helping me with a demonstration? Are you at all familiar with ward spells? I don't know shit. I have a ward spell, but I've never really used it. <laughs> I forgot I even had it. <laughs> That's what this lesson is for. Perfect time to try it out. Now, if you'll just stand right over there, I'll cast a spell at you, and you block it with the ward. Here we go. Here we go. Over there, please. Oh, just on this, opposite. this Eye of Agamotto? Okay. Let's see here. What is it? Alteration? Oh, God. Which symbol is alteration? This one? Nope. It must be... Restoration? Yeah, there it is. Okay. Wouldn't want anyone else in the way. Okay. Now, cast the ward spell and keep it up. What, what if I can't keep it up, Dolph's here? <laughs> Let's see, we better equip our robes just in case. Where'd they go? Robes of destruction? Ugh, is that all we've got? Fuck me. Okay, yeah. Let's do this just in case we need the extra regen and all that. All right, here I go, Tolf dear. Oh shit! Let's let's also unequip our weapon, huh? There we go. Good. Ha! You have to keep your ward up, or else this won't work. I don't want to hurt you. I'm I'm doing it, Tolf dear. Over there, please. Just opposite me. Wouldn't want anyone. Fucking hey, Tolf dear. Now cast the ward spell and keep it up. Hold still. Look out, Ilya! Look out, Ilya! Ilya, look out! You don't need to guard me from this, Ilya! It's okay! This is... This is school, Ilya! This is school! No! Oh God, all my magic's gone, Ilya. Are you happy now? <laughs> Let's see. Let's equip this. Is this about... About you, like, eating babies or something? <laughs> Gosh, we need to... Ilya, come on. Oh, fuck! Don't there, fuck me! I wasn't standing in this spot! Jesus Christ! Alright, alright, alright. Over there, please. Just opposite me. Okay. Wouldn't want anyone else in the way. Alright, yep. Now, cast the ward spell and keep it up. Here we go. You have to keep your ward up yep. or else this will Okay. Work. I don't want to hurt you. Uh, okay, okay, yep. Over there, please. Just oh. opposite me. For fuck's sake, Wouldn't this is just like real school. Alright. Cast. Yep. Hold still. Yep. Wow. Yeah, wow. Amazing. Well, I think this is an excellent start. <laughs> I'd like you all to continue practicing with wards, please. I think perhaps we're ready to begin exploring some of the various applications of magic throughout history. The college has undertaken a fascinating excavation in the ruins of Sarthol nearby. It's an excellent learning opportunity. I suggest we meet there in a few hours and see what awaits us inside. That's all for now. Thank you. Neat. All right, and we'll have to tend to that later. All right, we can come back to all this. All right, but for now, to see Skyrim let's speak with him. It's always encouraging to see the younger generations embracing education. Right, what you got for sale, Spells and incantations for those with the talent to cast them. I think that bald bastard, though, is the one we need to speak to, though, to get our, our good shit. Oh, look, we could buy this. Yeah, maybe we should. Maybe we'll buy some stone flesh. Hmm. What other stuff have you got here? Some wizard's items. Shitload of scrolls. Hmm. Extremely expensive for one cast, though, right? Look at that. Would you like to cast a fireball one time? For fucking 262 gold? Who goes around buying these? Right? Maybe some of the, like... 
big AOE ones, but this shit? <laughs> Who's buying this? How much money have you got? Maybe toward the end game, but by then you already know how to cast it, right? Okay. Should we learn this stone flesh? I think we, we should. Okay. Good. Can Spells I actually sell you some shit? For those with the talent to cast them. Oh, the college boots. Huh. I mean, we could pawn off our old robes. We should probably do that. There we go. I'll become naked. Wonderful. Do I have any other rings and stuff that I should sell off to him? I could sell off the gold ruby necklace, but maybe we'll hold on to it. Right. Like, how good is our necromancer's amulet? It's pretty good. Pretty, pretty good. Hmm. Yeah, I think we'll hold off. All right. Can you tell me more about wards? Wards? The key to wards is that they take time to charge. Not long, but you can't start casting with a fireball coming at you. Also, if your ward isn't negated by an incoming spell, it will recharge itself after a moment or two. Just be careful. Casting wards requires constant concentration, and you can easily find yourself drained of your magical reserves. Yeah, you know what doesn't cost constant concentration? Holding up a shield. <laughs> Thank goodness when you, like, get into the block stance, you aren't consistently draining stamina whenever you do it. Good lord. All right, what can you train me in alteration magic? I can certainly share a bit of what I know. Hmm. He's not too expensive, huh? All right, fair enough. Well, you know what? Let's let's buy some. I can certainly share a bit of what I know. Because alteration, we kind of need that. We can get our, what do you call it? There, let's buy five of them. Good. Yeah, maybe we'll keep doing this. That seems like a good move. Here, can Take I sell look. off some, like, I don't know, some of these? Oh, gosh, they are not worth much at all. <laughs> Never mind, Tolf dear. Never mind. Until next time. All right. Good talk. Here, you. I need shit for Put you for sure. Put on some damn clothes already. Oh, whoops. <laughs> yeah, that's right. I sold him my clothes. Fair enough. Tolf is so nice. <laughs> Just talking to me while I'm naked. All right. What else did I sell? Did I sell the... I sold the hat and the boots, but I was only wearing the the shirt, right? Yeah. Okay. Hey, Sergius Turianus. Enchanting services are one of the few things that keep us in touch with the rest of Skyrim. He'll enchant for me? I need something enchanted. I'm sure you can figure it out on your own. If you can't, perhaps Urag has a book you can read. Oh, okay. Well, thanks for nothing. Can't you do it for me? No. No, I can't. I have enough to keep me busy. View it as a chance to hone your craft. Yeah, that's true. No one ever enchants for you. Which is wild. Because <laughs> they made a lot of money off of me in past games. Alright. Hmm. Can you train me in enchanting? You've come to the right place. How much does he charge? I'd be happy to teach you. We probably don't need to. Wow, he's fucking expensive. Okay, but we don't need to anyway, because we've got enough enchanting supplies. All right, then. Hey, asshole, will, will you teach me anything, you fucking villain? I have many important things on my mind. Your concerns are not among them. Okay, see ya. Let's see. Where else can we go? Where's our Where's our conjuration dude? He's like some grim-looking old man, isn't he? With no hair? I think. I think he chills out usually in the in the area where everyone does, right? Let's take a peek and a poke. Over here. Oh, Shazbot. Here we are. Yeah, the Hall of Attainment. It's, oh. Oh, well. Well, what the fuck was up with that? <laughs> Did they, like, turn out the lights because it's, like, late? Or what? Did it bug out? I have no idea. <laughs> I was enjoying that. All right. I mean, it's still giving off a blue hue. Weird. Okay, where's our friend at? Can I actually take all this stuff? Well, I can, but I should not. We'll probably leave most of it here unless there's an emergency, right? That way it looks nice as we're frequenting the college and all that. Well, I bet that's him yawning. I bet that's the man we do seek. 
Is it Please you? don't bother Maribel? the Archmage unless it's absolutely necessary. No, doesn't she do like restoration or alteration or no? She does restoration, doesn't she? If there are any problems, let me know. It's my job to keep things running smoothly. Ah, oh, here we go. Where can I learn new spells? Well, that depends on what you're looking for. <laughs> Veralda can teach destruction spells and right. offers training in that school. Finnis is one of the best Finis. conjurers in all of Skyrim and can help with spells from that school. Don't let Tolfdir fool you. He's the preeminent scholar on alteration. One of the best in Tamriel and always willing to pass on his knowledge. Why would he fool me? If you can find him and focus his attention, there's a great deal Drevis can teach you about illusion magic. And finally, there's Colette. She may be difficult to get along with. She's very knowledgeable when it comes to restoration magic. Okay. Well, what's expected of me here? There are no expectations. This college is a place to study and practice magic freely. Hopefully any discoveries Please. made in your pursuits will be shared with the members of the college first. That way we all benefit. Okay, okay. Let's head on out over here. Enthir? Hmm. You're not who I'm looking for. Where's Finnis? Nerea? Yo, has anyone seen Finnis? Where is this fucking guy? I thought he was like a grim-looking bald man. That's why I remember. But maybe I'm misremembering it. <clears throat> oh, jeez. He's nowhere to be seen. Where does this dude even hang out at? Oh, gosh. And I'm getting hungry, too. Let's jump down here. Thank goodness it does not hurt me. <laughs> All right. The fire has gone so wild it's become invisible. Okay. Here. Maybe in one... Oh, is that him? Is this him? Yes! I care little for idle conversation, but perhaps you need help with conjuration magic. I do, I if do. If you require assistance with summoning techniques, please let me know. Here I am, letting you know. If you would, please oh. also contain your summons to the college grounds. The locals do not need to be agitated further by Atronachs roaming their town. The summoning of undead is even less advisable outside the college. Alright. Let's see, let's buy some spells first. So, you wish to master the arcane arts? I do! Let's buy... Ooh, Banish Daedra, Bound Bow. Let's get Bound Bow for sure. Let's see, a Frost Atronach, why not? We could also get Revenant. Yeah, let's buy a lot of this shit. There we go. Cool. Man, they're making a killing off of us. You know what, let's sell off Scroll of Dread Zombie. Right? Why not? There we go. Do we have anything else we could sell off? Not particular, huh? Alright. That'll have to do for now. Thanks, Finnis. Uh, let's see. Are there many conjurers outside the college? Yeah, but they're all fucked up necromancers. <laughs> not within society, no. Many who practice within the School of Conjuration do so on their own, secretly. Thallion is the only one I know who is public about what he does. He was once my teacher here, but left the college years ago. Thallion? What about Woundfirst the Unliving? <laughs> Let's see. Summoning undead isn't frowned upon? I sure no. Those archaic policies died out with the Mages Guild, and were never enforced here. Necromancy, as any other type of magic, is a tool to be used. Of course, non-mages may not see it that way, so we don't go around flaunting it. It is pretty fucked up, but also kind of funny sometimes. Why did Falion leave the college? He didn't like the Archmage. Hated dealing with him. Hated having to answer to him. Falion said he hated what this place was becoming, so he just left. Aaron found a note on his desk, and that was it. <gasps> that I was understand it. he settled down in Hjalmarch, oh, and shit. his presence there caused something of a problem. Oh, shit. Yeah, isn't there some wild shit going on in Hjalmarch? I mean, I guess there's some wild shit going on everywhere, right? <laughs> That's what makes the game interesting. <laughs> Can you teach me about Conjuration? I'll teach you some of what I know, but be careful. Okay. Whew, man, all so expensive. Yeah. Figures, you know, because we've got pretty high levels in that. Fair enough. I'm surprised he can uh, even teach us something, frankly. Time. All right. Let's head on out over here. Good, good, good. Hall of Attainment. 
We'll hang out here, that way we can get a little bit warmer. We'll probably rest up in between videos and all of that. Near this Invisifier, we'll warm up. Probably chow down on some, like, pheasant, whatever. Now, I suppose, when next we come back, we could hit up this shit, more quests here, or we could trek around and try to get some more power-ups, right? We could head over to, what was it, Solitude for the Thieves' Guild? I'm kind of down for that, right? We could <laughs> we could just not meet up at Sarthal for a long-ass time. We could do that. We could totally go that route. Because as far as I remember, there's not too many good stopping points in the College of Winterhold arc, right? It's kind of like continuous, not like, oh yeah, come back when you you can do whatever the hell, right? It's kind of, it, it keeps leading into one after the other, I believe. That said, it's been a long-ass time, and if there were a resting point, well, by nature, it was probably forgettable. <laughs> All right. But yeah, I think we won't continue on with the uh, college. You keep wanting to say Mage's Guild. I yeah, probably will anyway. But um, we'll, we won't continue on with the college. Instead, we'll go on with like Thieves' Guild or the main quest. That way we can get our Fusero Da. And yeah, that sounds good. We'll probably hold off on reading for today because it's getting rather late in real life. And <laughs> reading would just make it take longer for this video to get out. <laughs> Labor Day weekend has fucked me up. <laughs> Until next time, please take care of each other.